Welcome back to the All-Star Tournament. Expert Division Weekend Round. Hole number four. Here we're going to be setting up for a thorn shot to the funnel. This is our layup option. You need uh, P3 side spin, 3 plus wind, 3 plus ball. We're playing this P3 plus 10% mid numbers on the drive. Mid numbers. Uh, we're going to start with a quarterback 9 plus, switch to APOC 4 plus. We're always using 3 left spin on this drive. And we're adding top spin per wind strength. So at P3 max rest, you'll have the red ring touching the rough on the left with your QB 9. Switch to your APOC 3 left spin. If your wins are in the sixes, you don't need any top spin. If your wins are in the sevens, add 0.3 top spin. Wins in the eights, use 0.6 top spin. And if your wins are in the nines, use one top spin. Three left spin always. P3 10 mid, no overpower, no curl. Pull this one straight. We're looking for a drive of between 300 and 305. For the approach shot, the elevation for this shot plays P3, 0% at slider. And we're using one backspin and three left spin. And then we're going to find the funnel. With our ball guide just going through the right edge of the cup. And we're going to play it just before circle drop OP. So with spins added. What we're going to do is find the sticky spot with the ball guide glitching along and through the right edge of the hole. Uh, your second bounce should be right around the fringe line. The green fringe line or on the green or I'm not on the green, but just 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 on the fringe. Sometimes it's a little bit more in the fringe, it's more centered on the fringe. Sometimes it's by the edge. Shouldn't make any difference as long as the ball guide is going is touching the right center or the right edge of the cup right then the adjustment p30 just before circle drop and uh pull that one straight as well the only other thing that we need to really kind of look at is our plus yard check and it's a little unusual because we don't have a lot of uh great landmarks you know kind of in line with our shot so for the for the check what i'm doing is i'm lining up the fairway here the fairway line with my bullseye so when so line that up with your bullseye and then you'll just push it up until your white ring is touching the green, the fringe fairway line, and that gives you the plus yard you need. So just eye this up to where when you're pushing up, you're just pushing up right along that line. And you'll push up until your white ring touches. That'll give you a plus yard. That plus yard is going to give us our slider values. Uh, plus 6 is 88, 5 is 87, 4 is 85, 3 is 83, plus 2 is 82, 1 is 80, 0 is 88, minus 1 is 77, minus 2 is 75, and minus 3 is 73% slider, right? So we're at the plus 1 for this shot, so we played this one at 80% slider, 0 elevation, and don't forget, just before circle drop, OP. The good layup shot to the funnel, it's been consistent for us, just make sure that you find that sticky spot and that your ball guide is going through the right edge. Now, it doesn't have to stay there. 
right? So once you find your little spot, if you lift your finger up and it shifts slightly and the and the ball guide glitch goes away, don't worry about it. We're in the funnel, right? You're close enough to it that you should still be good. It doesn't you don't necessarily have to have the full ball guide going through the hole when you take the shot. You just need to be on the proper line and you need to make it glitch long to get yourself on the proper line. All right. Good luck, everyone. Hope you get the drop. We'll see you on the next one.